just, I like this idea of like playing a game and you sh it, it's completely normal. You're going, you're shooting like you're a hero. I was like, yeah. But then at the end of your like quest or whatever, someone comes up to you be like, um, oh, excuse me. Hey, hey. Oh, good job what you did. I'm really glad you got rid of those aliens. But someone's going to have to pay for this. And it's not us because <laughs> like you killed everyone that has anything to do with making money here. And so this whole idea of like balancing like so then you you play the game and you have to be cautious about your destruction. Like being a hero like sometimes you have to do like kind of bad stuff to like get to the end of like to to to, to, to solve a problem, solve a crime, sometimes you got to get you got to get dirty. You got to mm -hmm. get bad and you got to be as bad as bad guys. But like at the end of the day in real life, <laughs> like someone's going to hold you accountable for that. And so I just want there to be this real just real proper kind of nerdy guy who who keeps track of. I mean, he's like your sidekick, <laughs> and throughout the game, he's like, "Oh, um, now I see that you're going to select your rocket launcher. May I suggest you go for a more accurate rifle and avoid the catastrophe that's going to come from this? Because you can't afford it, sir. You can't afford it." And then this other balance of like you're doing all these missions to make money, but then you're spending all this money from these missions to pay for all the damage that you cause, and it's just like this cycle oh, that, that like never ends, and it's just real frustrating. That would be um, a really actually an awesome end of the mission screen, like kind of like the crash mode from Burnout, where yeah. like you finish it, it's like yeah, great right, way to go, and then it just scans over the city and racks up all the dollar signs <laughs> of all the all the shit you've done wrong. Look, guys, I know I know that bad guy is gonna just basically like ruin the world, but like I'm in <gasps> so much debt. <laughs> Another the last time I tried, you know? And but then also, but the other aspect of this is you also have to face the families of anyone <laughs> that you kill as well. And so they'll have these really dramatic cutscenes where you're like, da, 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 mission accomplished. And then wah, 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 the family comes up. This is little Gina. Uh, her father was that man with the bandana whose head you cut off. Um she knows her daddy was a bad guy, but he did his best. So she just she just has something to say to you, and then this little girl comes up and just pulls out this little you know this little piece of paper with I I wrote this letter to you. Why'd you take my daddy? And just, <laughs> but that happens with every bad guy you kill, <laughs> or any innocent person you kill. So like you literally could beat a mission and then have like 150,000 NPCs line up to like like wag their finger at you. Your game could be endless though, like even honestly. Like, Just they're, infinite they're, expansions. They're, the, infinite, the infinite paperwork DLC. 